Hey guys, and welcome back to Misha's Corner. I just wanted to pop in real quick on you guys and show you this delicious, easy, simple shrimp sausage skillet that I made for my baby father um, for his lunch break today. So I have some andouille sausage here. I have a half a pound of shrimp. I could have sworn I pulled the bowl of shrimp <laughs> to the bowl, but to the uh, screen, but you'll be able to see it in a minute. I have jalapeno, lemon, garlic, butter, and some herbs. So to the shrimp, I'm going to season it up with Spicy Girl. As you guys know, Spicy Girl is now back in stock as well as its lit lemon pepper. And the link will be below. For all the people that ordered over the past few days, thank you so much for your support. And your packages were dropped off. So you want to season this up like this and let it sit for like, I don't know, maybe five minutes. It doesn't need to sit that long. Now, this is a mini cast iron skillet. As you, as you can see, once I put like one shrimp down, the bottom of the pan is almost filled up because it's really small. I put it on the stove to see if you guys can actually see how small it was. But to me, it's not really showing how small it is. But it's really small. And I'm just going to pop some shrimp on the bottom. And basically what you're doing is layering. And so I'm going to layer in some shrimp, layering some andouille sausage or your favorite sausage, uh, some jalapeno the garlic the lemon and repeat the process so you guys today honey when i went to go do my walk <laughs> um i made it to the highway y'all i'm so proud of myself let me tell you something a few weeks ago when i started uh walking this new trail i could not make it y'all i was suffering i couldn't make it and today i just i don't know i just kept going kept going and i was fine and i made it so i got a pretty good walk workout in this morning so i just wanted to share that with y'all because i'm actually proud of it you know you know because i'm very you know i was very out of shape like very out of shape and so, you know, these little milestones just cheer me up a bit. You know, we all going through a lot right now. And that definitely cheered me up. So I'm going to keep going. And hopefully I could go even further. So now I'm just going to keep layering the shrimp. And I'll show you guys what that looks like. Now that the shrimp and sausage is laid, I'm going to start putting pieces of butter on here. I know it looks like a lot, but I promise you it's only three tablespoons that I cut up in small cubes. And I didn't even use all of it. So I just put just enough so it can steam once it's in the air fryer. Yes, I did say the air fryer, child. I didn't cut no oven on today. <laughs> However, if you don't have an air fryer, of course, you could pop this in the oven. Don't worry. You're good to go. Remember, all ingredient measurements will be in my description box and so make sure you check that out the other half of the lemon i squeeze the juice right over top and now i'm gonna pop it in the air fryer all right so now i'm just gonna put it in my heated preheated um air fryer if you have a really small baby one then you know you already know you have to use the oven but i have a pretty big air fryer and this is what it looks like look how bubbly golden delicious Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have to probably make this with chicken. I always tell y'all that. And then I'm just gonna take the buttery, lemony sauce and pour it all over the shrimp. Oh my goodness. And then I use some good andouille sausage too. So you know, all them juices just all up and through that shrimp, okay? So make sure you guys give this recipe a try. If you do, tag me, let me know what you think. And I'll catch you guys on my next video. Bye.